Hey YouTubers, today I'm going to show you me UI working on my LE TV phone. What I say today here applies to all LE TV phones and versions of me UI can be found and installed on all of them. So me UI as an introduction is Xiaomi's operating system. It's pretty much in the works. It's been in the works for since 2010, so it's in, you know, it's a 5 year old operating system. It's pretty mature. And the reason why you probably want to upgrade to this is it fixes LE TV's operating system's issues. First of all, I want to say very clearly that LE TV, they've been making phones for one year only. So their operating system is probably new and there's a lot of features that are still lacking. For example, if you own an LE TV phone, you probably know that some apps don't run, notably the Nova Launcher. Also, there are some poor English translations on their menus. The download manager is pretty bad. Also, there's a lack of overall features. So, for that reason, you probably want to migrate to the Xiaomi Mi UI OS. Here, in this video, I'm going to show you how it works and how fluidly it works on the phone. And I will hopefully cons help you consider if you should make the swap or not. Let me show you a few things off first. Show you the settings menu. So here we use the Xiaomi's MIUI settings menu. The version of MIUI I've got installed is MIUI 7, 5.11, actually 5.12.11. So this is probably one of the latest versions that came out. The Android version is 5.0.2, so Lollipop. And also the phone model that I'm using it on is the LETV X600. The settings menu on Xiaomi systems is much cleaner and very fluid. Because the system's been out in India and other global countries, the English version translation is actually extremely good. In terms of fluidity, all menus work very well. I got my favorite Nova launcher here. And this launcher was the one that didn't work very well with the original LE TV system. In terms of menu fluidity, you can see that the menus are extremely fluid and the system functions extremely responsively. The camera app itself works extremely well as well. So you want to take some picture of something. The MIUI interfaces, the MIUI camera is pretty good as well. So here we go, that's pretty much MIUI working perfectly on my phone. I have a written review, actually I've written instructions on how to swap your UI over. I would like to put a warning here that's, that changing the operating system on these phones always involves a certain amount of risk and of course it involves wiping your phone. So please keep that in mind when you want to do it. I do have the written review up, on. I'm going to put a link below. Also, I will make a video review, so leave a comment on which phone you want me to do a video instruction guide on how to change the Choose Me UI. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, cl please click the like button below and subscribe to my channel.